Hey everybody, Psychosaurus is here, welcome back to Age of Empires Online, and today we are gonna revisit another legendary quest that gets reworked for the Halloween event. And this one is called Bring Out Your Dead, and you might remember this one as one of those quests I did not like that much, but it's been changed, and I would say quite a lot actually. So the main changes, and this has been for a while now, that the one big change was that the enemy units lost their bonus multipliers, so they were no longer that strong, they, and no longer are that strong as they used to be, which was very annoying. Believe me, I did not... You definitely would not enjoy them previously. But it is what it is now. But pretty much the idea of the quest is still the same, no matter what. So, if you don't remember, it's this map where you have, I would say, these annoying volcanoes around you. And they are not nice. Since they do a lot of damage to your units. And you can see there's a lot of space here, but what we are gonna do, and pretty much what I've been always doing, is build up a wall here. Okay, let's do this. We can do this. And this. Okay, there's a hole there. Remember about that. Come on. Man, this is annoying. Like, come on, you're right next to it. Okay, can you do that? No, no. Okay, we need a lot of spearmen. Yeah, I don't know, remember what's like a good number. I think six. We need to also get back. Once the walls are done, that's gonna be good. You can do it like this, and then we can just get these. Okay, we need to get these areas. Come on, build this. Okay. Great. Get out of there, come on. Cannot be there. Okay, and if you don't remember what's actually going on in this quest, is whenever you age up, there will be a wave of mummies spawning. And yeah, it's quite annoying. Okay, so we get some Axemen. We can get that out of the way. See, mummies spawning. Okay, get a market. I think this is a good spot, should be at least. Send it over here. But unfortunately, as you see, the caravans will be going through the. through the volcano. So that's quite a big disadvantage. So we are gonna need some healer here as well. Okay, let's build up these. How's this? Okay, there's an attack wave. These are actually coming quite early. We should upgrade these. We can get 
those yet. It's unfortunate. Get me more, more priestess. Start mining the stone. Yeah, they are annoying this early. Come on. This running. Mm. Let's get this because I need like three towers here to be able to defend. I guess it's currently okay to just get free. So. Yes, I won't need more. See the caravan took the damage. Yeah, that's quite annoying. And it's like 50 damage. Man. Okay, let's get some gold miners because gold is very important. Okay, this is nice, but I might have to upgrade the priestess healing. So we are gonna need a touch of Ra, I think the side of the sun. But yeah, back to the quest. I did not say what the objectives are. As you can see, we have the time challenge. There is a wonder right over here. And I believe this is revealed now naturally, or is it not? Did I reveal it or was it revealed before? I think yeah, you have to reveal it. Let's build a wall so they don't annoy us this early. We are gonna prepare some of those units. Let's get one more priestess. Get two more axemen over here. if you haven't realized yet by the advisors but yeah we're going for elephants and I could definitely use more more houses great we are gonna need armories Okay, let's build a temple. Should be getting more units just in case. I'm gonna make sure we don't lose this area. A few more towers does not hurt. Also, I need to warn you before reaching Golden Age, you need to make sure you have some anti-infantry units here because this volcano will actually spawn one of the guardians, so you better be ready for that. So some anti-infantry units should be fine. Let's get 
two units up and ready. You better hurry up because it doesn't seem like it, but 20 minutes can be quite an issue to get the job done here for the time challenge. Okay, let's get the healing upgrades. Okay, there they are, being annoying. Get the upgrades. Do this. Great. Where do I put these? Yeah, yeah, you're annoying. You can't get through. See how annoying they are. Okay, let me build this watch post right over here. And if I remember correctly, you don't want to build too much stuff here because otherwise they'll just attack in the walls, which is. Don't ask me why it's happening, but it's happening. Okay, it's fine. Get this done. Main objectives, forgot to mention. Destroy town centers, kill headless horseman who's in this area. The one that destroyed, that's the time challenge. Right here. No palettes, no stone throwers, no ranged units. Now, if you want to cheese it a little bit, you can actually cut down these trees, pick Darius H4, and just destroy the wonder from this area. That's also fun <laughs> to do. Okay, obviously we are using the Marduk's shield for maximum efficiency of the elephants. Okay, we are gonna need a lot more fortresses. That's very important. guys are out of gold here. Alrighty then. And then we build it right here. Then we just build some town center around. I hope you're making it up fast enough. are allowed so we can just grab a set here and we can do this didn't i have one more oh yeah on stone then we just go Final upgrades. That's good. 
important. Do we have some alternative stone? I don't think so. I can delete you. You wanna get in and destroy the productions as soon as possible. number of units, that's what I mean, it's so annoying to deal with this quest. Okay, after the stables I would like to go, but unfortunately no, they won't allow me. did not really like this quest already because like the unit spam come on and someone's the notes actually said that it's supposed to be like this I guess if early which you could tell it's lying because they, they are there for like this if early now I just need to get in there come on God, stop it Sound turn off. Oh no, that's not nice. Won't break this already. Yeah, my sound actually broken right now. Oh boy. Okay, hurry up. We need to get over here. I could go through the wall, but then I would also open the path to the enemy AI, which is not nice. But okay, let's get rid of the villagers here. That's right, bunch. Great. Oh boy, what's going on here? Oh, come on! Are you serious? 
Why are you there? Okay, that's it. Let's break it before they break us. Come on. See, this is what I mean. They're annoying. God damn, break this. All of it. Get the damn barracks. Come on over here. Oh boy, it's a nice quiet quest suddenly, right? <laughs> uh, whatever. Okay, it's alright. We can fix this later. Okay, how many caravans? 22, that's fine. Break. Break. You can see elephants are pretty nice now. <laughs> I don't know why, but it, it feels like this build works with me, but it's super expensive. Like sets, light spear, Marduk's shield, Minotaur's golden hide. Man, it's super expensive build. Okay, let's get rid of this and I would like to have the market already. Okay, you guys, I can get rid of you, it's not a problem. But hopefully we'll be done soon. Okay, let's start building some fortresses here so we don't have to go like long distances to get this done hey okay, come on set this here which is nice for the healing all right then Let's buy some of this, get some of this, make sure everything is dead. Okay, let's get to the boss area. Let's do this, 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 spread the damage, why not? Okay, this is annoying. Oh, come on, where did you come from? Asley, where did you come from? I'll build some barracks because then I'll be taking those camps and Okay, let's split this up. Okay, these guys are very annoying. This is where I would feel better if I had the 
I, I not Ice Kings. The Piercing Frost Light Spear because this armor is quite huge, but luckily elephants don't really need it. Just kill them with the splash. But yeah, Axeman would be better. Uh, okay. And such a lovely sound, right? <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Whatever. We can live with this somehow. Okay, now the horseman is in this area, and this is very annoying because this lava area does a lot of damage. So you don't really want to fight on it. It's kind of unfortunate, but we have to do that actually. But luckily, we can just lure the horseman to fight under the towers. Okay, spread the villagers to build as fast as possible. Okay, fight them off. Like, there's a lot of these guys, and it just. I mean, they, they don't have that much health, like sure, it's a lot of health, but it's mainly the armor that's the issue here, because you need to do like three times the amount, so it's only over 10,000 damage, and they also heal some of it back, so super annoying. Towers should help, luckily I have some Igno armor on them, so that should speed it up a little bit. Why are you here even? Come on, man. I know there's like area, there's like the auger there and it's like some kind of sacrificial pit right there. Okay, just focus down the horseman. You need to remember, this horseman has no pierce armor in this quest. So, building towers here since you cannot build, you cannot train ranged units. And if you don't have siege with pierce damage, then obviously you need to build the towers. So yeah, come on, take it out. I have more than enough towers. And each of them do how much? 70 DPS? It's not bad. Okay, there we go. Okay. Okay, so the quest is done. Luckily we survived this. And you, you, you saw it, okay? Like I said, don't build too close to the wall. And when you build, it's ha it has to be just few towers, okay? So like 5,000 max. I think it was the watch post that was like overkill there. And that was it. But yeah, that could have been much more. Okay, let me just delete some of these villagers. So we actually just train the Axemen. Whatever, but yeah, now we are just going after the damn treasure camps, and yes, it's annoying with the elephants, it's not the best idea to do it with elephants, since it takes a while to kill one of them, so once they run out because of the splash damage, you need to do something like this, I mean, they do the damage, but it's just... Yeah, not the most effective damage. You need them to be close to get to each other to actually make it work. Oh, where did this tower come from? Come on! Who did who did this? Who built this tower? Whatever. Okay, let's get over here. So yeah. As you could see, just build your defenses. You don't have to you don't have to age up right away and I don't recommend doing so because you can you could see the mummies spawning. So you wanna first train some units to actually be able to defend against the mummies, which few spearmen should be more than enough. So do that and right away go up here, build a wall. I don't know if going a little bit further would also help. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. But yeah, build a wall, few towers, try to build the stuff like right over here and don't build too much over there. 
I think that's what hurted me why they came and destroyed the wall because I built the extra watch post there you don't want to build too much there okay and even then I'm not 100% sure that works okay so don't call me on that exactly but usually the best experience I had was like built far away from the wall like in this area and not anywhere near that wall anymore just a few towers like five max and that's it after that yeah just build up make sure you have some units defending against the mummies be ready for the guardian spawning once you reach golden age and yeah just start pushing and definitely focus down the production buildings as soon as possible you could see like there was a lot of units if i did not destroy the barracks there would be a lot more okay so that was quite annoying and yeah once you deal with them you're going to this area make sure to build towers because they do pierce damage and the horseman has no pierce armor so towers will be great there but if you have some siege units that do pierce damage or maybe some other units as well who knows maybe you're playing as greeks using sarisophoroi that is also possible so yeah pierce damage against that horseman and preferably have some ignore armor or crush damage against those guardians over here like those huge waves i guess that's all i have to say so treasure camps as you could see behind the first wall you'll find the first treasure camp then second camp is in the second base and you need to go like to the left corner of the base right here then from the horseman area if you go south there you will find a third camp and then you go north or northeast i should uh, sorry northwest northwest and here you will find the last treasure camp there's four in total we got them all we got them all okay so let's head back and you can see i don't really like this quest because there's just a lot of units and this is something i never liked about this quest because i feel i always felt like there was too many units in this quest so it's not one of my most favorites but yeah rewards three stars three days for the event once the event is gone hey it's gonna be six days again so 60 empire points 4000 coins 675 halloween points that's actually pretty good but remember it used to be more because you were getting the 100 halloween points for each secondary objective and this quest has three of those so there's a lot of there would have been a lot more rewards for this but whatever 675 is still quite a good amount then we have five chests five of each material thousand coins and two chests per option so time challenge for the wonder no palins no ranged so a lot of extra materials once the event is over yeah this quest can be quite rewarding but like i said it's not one of my most favorite quests okay give me the rewards okay not looking great uh, okay this is nice stuff but what do i care and we got up of this uh, not the greatest stats like damage is very good but the bonus could have been higher but it's still pretty good okay those are the rewards that was bring out your dead so tell me what you think about this quest i honestly don't see any difference about this quest to be honest like maybe not that many units coming at you all the time like the bigger attacks are delayed but maybe that's about it i honestly don't see a really huge difference here it just feels like the same quest if i'm not mistaken it was in the patch now so it should be the it should have been changed i just don't see the difference really maybe it's just my feeling what do i know so tell me what you think if you agree that it's pretty much the same nothing really changed but yet do you like this quest whatever and yeah if you enjoyed this please press the like button if you want to see more subscribe to the channel oh yeah and before i forget there was actually another update another maintenance that actually change something about some of the quests it should have been just small changes so i'm not really gonna go through those quests but most important the prices for the craftable halloween event 
gear has been changed. Like, practically all of the items were touched, if I'm not mistaken. Except the store one. We can quickly check those. Unless the game crashes on me for some reason. Uh, it's just broken sound. But yeah, if we take a look, most of these material uh, craftables right here have become cheaper except for the fire flask and the siege arm. As you can see, they are 40 now. The bow is also 40. I think it was 50. It was either 50 or 45, I don't remember. Shield was 50, now it's only 35, so if you want to craft the shield, now it's even better. Although, yes, I'm kind of sad because I lost some extra materials because of that. Sword is now 80 instead of 100, and the axe is also 40 instead of... And I think this was like 70, was it 70? I, I mean, it was pretty high. And then the Zahax Idol has been actually moved to the store and it cost 18,000. I think the amulet actually became cheaper. I think that one was 18,000. Now it's the idol. So yeah, if you want the idol and now it's at the store, not craftable anymore. Okay, and that's all for me. Just so I mentioned this before I forget. I don't really want to go through those changes. So yeah, this was Cycle Service. I'll see you next time. Bye.